Bloody, it is I, Helgit. You know me from my paper arts crafting. However, I've recently taken a liking to baking. Today, I've made some delicious Valentine sugar cookies. Look at that heart. I'm going to decorate them today with you, of course. Now, what expertise have I, you might ask, to be teaching you peons about decorating sugar cookies? None is the answer, but I do hope you'll enjoy the trip with me. Valentine's sprinkles, look at that lovely array of colours. And then we've got a nice pile that looks like glue has spilled. It is in fact not glue, it is royal icing. We are that special. And look at this lovely white icing in the glass because I realise if I just set it out on the counter, I just get a large icing spill. I've coloured some pink as well. So we'll get started and I'll begin by flooding my cookies. I've just snipped the top of that little icing bag and now we are going to go to town as it were. Let's try this far over here that is a wee bit bumpy I would say. Bumpier the better. Why? Because we don't know what we're doing for right now. Oh gracious, I'm popping it out my hand! That's wonderful. That's not how the book was. Right, okay, just slop it back in there then and drip around. Oh gracious, it's popping out everywhere. Well, look at that. We'll come back later when I've figured it out. Oh please! Alright, I've managed to force two of them without losing much more realizing and now I'm undoing the Valentine sprinkles. There we go. Let's see what we've got here. As it turns out, maybe I should not have had my first ever attempt at decorating sugar cookies on camera, but nonetheless here we are. Oh god. That's fine. Oh god. That's right. It's just Popping out everywhere. Let's see. Don't they have so oh, gracious? Gracious me. More is coming out of the top than at the bottom. Ugh. If we can manage the piping, they said I could just dip the cookie into the royal icing proper. So let's see how that fares for us, shall we? Here it is a big basin of royal icing and let's just plop it lightly hover and then fold it over oh look at that lovely if i do say so myself oh this is this is much preferred technique wise <laughs> let's try it again i'll just show you there we are dunk it and recover there we are Lovely. All right, look, I made a purple one as well. Just a little bit of blue and red will do the trick. And I figured out that dunking is definitely the preferred method. So we'll take this one, for example, hopefully it fits. This is a messy endeavor, isn't it not? Oh, gracious. Well, it doesn't fit. Oh, what are we doing? Now we will get some sprinkles. Oh gracious. Use caution not to dump too many sprinkles at once or you will create sort of a glut of sprinkles as I did on this one. If you can see it looks like an overpopulicity. <laughs> Just look at these delectable treats. It would seem that it was uh, not an arduous process to create. But indeed, you as well as I know better. Don't be fooled by those lovely posts on social media. They don't tell you about all the mess they've made before they take the pictures. Who even leaves a royal icing stain on the counter so that you can puzzle whether it was actually royal icing or pigeon droppings. However, 
Golden Drums to everyone and happy baking. Yeah.